Yerp. What is good, J.I. Squad? And welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with another banger video. I don't know if you guys can tell by the quality of this video, but we are back on the vlogging camera, man. Funny story, I actually lost both chargers for my batteries for my camera. And I knew they were somewhere in the house, but I couldn't find exactly where they were. So I literally been vlogging on my phone the past couple of vlogs that you guys been seeing. So that's why, you know, the quality kind of took a hit. Now, if you don't really notice a change in quality, it's probably simply because of the settings that the video is on. So you got to click your screen and then go to the settings like within the video. And it's like, um, it'll say like quality and just put it on highest quality possible and you should be straight that's only for like if you're watching on your iphone or your computer if you're on your tv you should be straight but if you're on your iphone or computer or tablet or whatever then try that and it should change the quality but that being said you guys see the title and the thumbnail of this video we're gonna stop all the jibber jabber and get straight to the video today we're gonna be rewiring the ji galaxy it is stupid hot outside right now um, but for those of you who don't know, I do have the Rolls Royce Wraith Starlight headliner in the car. I call it the JI Galaxy. There's 1150 stars in my headliner. I'm going to be rewiring that to where it's cutting on like the P3 gauge does and the AEM gauge does whenever the car is in accessory mode or has power. So that way I don't have to turn it on and off with the remote. It'll just do it whenever the car cuts on like a Rolls Royce. So let's go ahead, roll that intro and get straight into this banger. Yeah, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it. We in with the sub and in the cut with it. Please none of the talks, I heard enough of it. Like, what you gonna do? Where you at? Who you with? You ain't really about this. Don't talk about it. Really on the move, on the map, never slip. Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it. Real eyes, real lives, real lives. All the time stand on it. If we said it, we don't walk around it. Loose lips, ink ships, red cup, blue strips, new phone, who this? No, we don't allow it. Really on go, I don't know what's an off day. Now we on road, keep us. Alright y'all, so I'm gonna go ahead and turn like the brightness down so y'all can really see, but this is the JI Galaxy. You dig what I'm saying? I'm in the car right now. As y'all can see, it goes crazy. But it is controlled by a remote or an app on my phone. So that being said, I want to set it up to where when the car has power, then the headliner cuts on just like the P3 and the AEM gauge do. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually about to take both of the power wires from the two boxes because I have two separate boxes. That's why you can see it's two different colors. And I'm just going to splice them together and then I'm going to splice into the power wire for the P3 gauge and the AEM gauge because those are all ran on the same one. A dual fuse system um so it should be cool i shouldn't blow any fuses or anything like that it shouldn't be too much current so we should be straight your boy sweating mad buckets right now so hit that like button no cap but let's go ahead and get to work man first we got to disconnect the battery and then we can start messing with the wires and see where we're gonna run them through and stuff like that because you know ji you already know it got to be oem plus it got to be clean you dig all right y'all as y'all can see the hood is open right now you did what i'm saying and this is the current positive wire for my p3 gauge and my aem wide band they are wired up to these two fuses this is what i was telling you guys about um so what we're gonna do right now i've already kind of ran this power wire this power wire through the fender and i've got it running inside of the car now i don't know how well y'all can see that yeah y'all can see so yeah, it's running inside the car now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull this all the way through and I'm gonna tuck it in here inside of this plastic with the carpet and I'm gonna pass it through and then we're gonna come all the way back here to the battery. And as you guys can see, we got the two positive wires for both of the boxes right here. We're gonna disconnect them, splice them together and then splice them with that wire. And we should be good to go, man, no cap. All right, y'all, so right now I got everything wired up. We just testing right now. We're gonna see if it works. If it works, then I'm gonna go ahead and clean everything up and I'll show y'all how it go. All right, y'all, moment of truth. As y'all can see, no lights, car is off. Press and hold the start button to get these cars into accessory mode if you didn't know. Accessory mode, and we got stars, baby. Let's go. So, 
got all the gauges working and everything so now the stars will cut on whenever the car cuts on and I don't have to do it by the remote anymore so with that being said I'm gonna go ahead clean up the wires basically finalize everything that I just set up and we're good to go as far as the headliner goes I'm super stoked about that that's probably gonna wrap up today's video after I clean everything up so you guys just stay tuned and um, I'll show you guys the finished product since this video doesn't need to go up today I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait till nighttime when you guys can really actually see the stars for real and that's when I'll show you guys the end product but I'm gonna go ahead and tuck this wire right here I don't know if y'all can see that yeah tuck this wire right here clean up all the connections and we should be good to go man let's get it I'm stoked the next day all right y'all so like the spongebob announcer just said it did it is the next day um i decided to wait till the daytime to show you guys the wiring um because if i was going to show y'all at night y'all wouldn't be able to see anything so go to the car and show y'all what's good so as y'all can see all you can see is the wire from right here but after that it's literally clean tucked all the way through can't even see anything in the back seat, literally. Don't mind my little, you know, protein joint, you feel me? But yeah, you can't even see that. Then you go to the trunk, carbon fiber, you know, and you still cannot see anything. No wires. It's all cleaned up and tucked away. Now, we can go ahead and jump to the night scene where you see the stars. All right, you guys, so as y'all can see, we are currently at the JIHQ. And I want to go ahead and show you guys what we ended up doing in this vlog. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the lights off and I'm going to roll the windows down with the remote. And then I'm going to remote start the car and show you guys how the lights cut on. And then I'll uh, we'll go ahead and roll that out and close this video up. So let's go ahead and get it. Lights off, completely dark. I'm going to hit the unlock button. Roll the windows down. All right, as y'all can see, Nothing. you guys so that being said man that is gonna wrap it up for today's vlog as you guys saw man we successfully rewired my ji galaxy to cut on and turn off whenever the car turns on and off um today was 100 percent successful because we were able to do that and i'm super stoked about that that's crazy i don't know if somebody hit my car or what but I'm just back here right now, and this exhaust tip is like, I see that spot right there that's like mad clean. I don't, that's just interesting. I don't know. That kind of just threw me off, I'm not going to lie. If you look at all the exhaust tips, like they're all dirty, and then that one just has that clean silver lining right there. Like something scraped, like scraped against it, I don't know. But... I'm going to go ahead, go inside, edit this video, and upload it for you guys. Let's go ahead and roll that outro. If you guys are new, hit the subscribe button, turn on post notifications. Drop a comment in the comment section down below. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.